You ever been out just doing your own thing when you run across someone doing this? You're not quite sure at first why, but that guy seems odd. Then it hits you. He's not swinging his arms when he walks. That's weird. It's wrong. And it makes you wonder. I'm old. Hey, Midlife Drafty here. I hope you all are having a fantastic day. If you've ever seen something that made you think WTF, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button and click the notification bell so you're up to date when new videos come out. All right, before we begin, I wanna make it clear. I'm not making fun of anybody with disabilities or social issues or anything of that nature. It's just one of those things that you immediately notice and it registers in your brain as odd. Then once it's registered, you just move on with your day. But initially, you think, what the f It would be the same thing as if you saw, you know, say this. Now this is odd and would make you think what the hell's going on the first time you saw it. But then afterwards, You'd be all right, hopefully. So please, if you're the leader of a no arm moving army, please don't come looking for me. I'm just making some commentary. Come on guys, he's in here. Anyway, it got me to thinking, why do we swing our arms? Turns out, scientists have been wondering the same thing for a long time, but it wasn't until 2009 that they actually did a formal study. Now, I assumed, like everybody probably, that you swing your arms to keep yourself balanced. But apparently, I was wrong. The main reason we swing our arms is to conserve energy. Can you believe that? Researchers found that on average, people who don't swing their arms when they walk use 12% more energy than those of us who walk naturally. And by naturally, I mean left foot forward, right arm forward, and vice versa. They also found that if you move your left arm and right leg at the same time, you know, kind of doing this robot thing, you use 26% more energy than walking normally. Sounds like a new fitness craze, doesn't it? Ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the first international wonky run races. Runners, on your mark, get set. So is that a good exercise regimen? Actually, no. Scientists say if you suppress your natural movements, you could do damage to your spine. Yeah, I knew I had her at the beginning because she's an amateur and I'm a pro. You don't just come in here with normal walking action and think you can win this kind of race. I've been at it all. So, make sure you swing those arms when you're strolling around. And swing that mouse on down and hit the subscribe button. And if you're one of those who doesn't swing your arms when you walk, just know you could be damaging your spine. And you make the rest of us wonder...